The following triple threat contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring. From every man's nightmare, weighing in at 250 pounds, the man called Sting. Man, listening to the reaction this guy gets from a crowd never gets old. Three of WWE's most polarizing figures set to square off here in this triple threat match. And approaching the ring from Truth or Consequences, New Mexico, weighing in at 287 pounds, Cactus Jack. This guy will settle for nothing short of a victory here tonight. If this one doesn't end up on a highlight reel somewhere, I'll be incredibly surprised. And approaching the ring from Charlotte, North Carolina, weighing in at 243 pounds, the Nature Boy, Ric Flair. Well, this superstar has all the tools needed to win this one. Now let's see if he can put them together. I don't care who you are. You get butterflies each time your name gets announced and you're headed toward that WWE ring. You mean the wrestling god got nervous? Well, not me, but everybody else. And here we go in this Anything Goes match. Flair is weathering this violent storm. He's in big trouble. This is not the position. Check it out, Ric Flair. What can you tell us right now? The master of the figure four leg lock will turn you into a pretzel. This kind of offense he's known for. Yeah, you're right about that. He's made a name for himself with this. Oh, what a slam! What? 
what impact? Oh, once you get out of the ring, anything can happen. You've got exposed steel, concrete, the barricades, and all of it can be used to cause massive damage. Folks, it's become a legend in our business that when Sting was training for his career in the ring under the legendary Red Bastine, he also trained with the man who became the Ultimate Warrior. They eventually formed a tag team and ended up in the same territory I was in back in Memphis, Tennessee. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. Man, I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. Cactus Jack reverses it. He's swinging for the fences with that sledgehammer. And a lethal chop rains down. You're right, that chop was brutal. Delivering the damage to the chest now. A quick reversal by Ric Flair. Oh, out of nowhere. Oh, wait, nice reversal. Flair goes down hard. You know, at this point in his career, Flair can't take too many more of those attacks. Cactus Jack being pressed hard. Cactus Jack reverses it. Look out what's going on here. Hey, nice move. Well, we're on the move here. Looks like he's pinpointing the back. Oh, out here you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. One mistake, one moment of hesitation, and you could find yourself in a world of hurt. Oh, that'll give you a headache. Wow, that was a wild strike. Talk about missing the target. Yeah, it looked like it was completely out of desperation. Look at Flair, zeroing in on his opponent with the precision of a fine craftsman at work. It's like the Nature Boy is going a mile a minute in there. Rick's always been revered for his superior cardiovascular conditioning. That'll have you worrying about long-term injuries for sure. That wild strike found nothing but empty air that time. <laughs> Man, that's what you call swinging for the fences and missing. So damaging. The reversal from Nate. I wouldn't be surprised to see Cactus Jack soften up the head here a bit in preparation for his vicious double arm DDT. Pushing his opponent to the limit here. Oh, and he missed that one. God, that's got to hurt. Yeah, you're not doing any damage with swings like that, but keep doing it. The breeze may give him a cold. Why is the guy his opponent? What's he going for here? Makes the cover. One, two, three. What a win. Man, he's got to feel great. Oh, they threw everything they had at each other in this match. Here's your winner, Cactus Jack. Big, big win here in this triple threat match. What a performance. Wow, I can't believe the amount of punishment that had to be inflicted in order for those shoulders to stay down for a three count. Thank you again for joining us tonight as we come to you live from historic Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, the home of WWE Hall of Famer Bruno Sammartino.